All right, this is going to be the ultimate guide to liquidity sweeps and how to understand them. So uh, pretty much what liquidity sweeps is, guys, is pretty much the market grabbing ammo before the market does its actual move. Now, let me go ahead and show you guys what I mean. But before we can even understand what a liquidity sweep what a liquidity sweep even is we need to go ahead and draw our higher time frame levels so i need you guys to go ahead and start off on the daily here we need to go ahead and draw a rectangle on the all-time highs that you guys go ahead and see here and then you guys can go ahead and draw a zone at the most recent lows as well from there i want you guys to go ahead and scale down the four hour time frame and you guys can also go to indicators and use the swing levels and liquidity by leviathan indicator here to go ahead and find the mini zones in between the actual ranges now i'm just going to go ahead and draw a zone here just for example uh, due to the fact that I do see a zone here. So let me go ahead and hide this. Boom. And as you guys can see here, uh, we do have this ping pong structure being created here. So now, what is the liquidity sweep? So as you guys can see here, we are getting some shorting from all-time highs, letting us know that overall the market right now is bearish trend due to the fact that we didn't break out in all-time highs over here. Now, what the liquidity sweep is going to do is it's going to go ahead and grab ammo. So as you guys can see here, market went all the way up. Boom, grab ammo, and then decided to just dump back down. That's what it is, guys. It's going to go ahead and grab the ammunition it needs in order to go ahead and do volatile moves down. So in order for breakouts to happen or in order for reversals to happen, there needs to be a large amount of money at those key institutionalized levels. You guys can find those levels by turning on your higher time frames, and you guys can easily see them. Then you guys can scale down to the five minute and stuff like that and start playing the ranges via there. So don't get chopped up, guys. You need to just start understanding that all the liquidity sweep is is the market grabbing ammo before the market does its actual move here. So as you guys can see here, we have this prime signal of buying, and uh, boom, market ended up just um, after market dumped down, uh, market ended up, boom, collected enough ammo from the all the sellers, and then there was a high amount of demand for the uh, Dow Jones here, and then there decided to be a bottom near this structure that was created here from the January and December price range here, as well as, uh, yeah, December to January price range um, from the left here, as you guys can see. So these zones are valid on our current zones as well so as you guys can see all of these swing point lows here match up and that's what's going to give you your ideal uh, institutionalized level to give you a confirmation that buying is going to be valid here now the fact that all-time highs shorted back into this level uh, gave us enough ammunition to go ahead and uh, bounce back up into all-time highs. So no matter what time frame you guys are on, it doesn't really matter. Liquidity sweep is the same thing, guys. That's all it is. is the market grabbing ammunition before it does the real move. Now, as you guys can see here, market bounced down here. Now, if market bounces up, all it's going to do is get, uh, get enough buyers in the market. So then market can go ahead and do a huge sell-off back into this low here. Why? Because we rejected all-time highs and we didn't end up breaking out. Or what could also be happening is market is going to go ahead and dump down here, uh, get all the sellers out of the market, and then there's going to be a heavy amount of buying here, just like we had here at this swing point. And then market can go ahead and retrace back up. But we'll go ahead and see. But ideally, since market is, uh, since we know buyers are um, could possibly be present here, why don't we just wait for a breakout? Because we know once price breaks this key level of buying, then we're going to get confirmed selling down to the next level. So go ahead and just do that, or you guys can uh, try for the reversal if you want. I see we're starting to get some bullish price action near the zone, but we'll go ahead and we'll see here how it develops in a minute. Um, what throughout the next course of uh, days and stuff like that, we'll wait for uh, Tuesday as uh, it's Memorial Day on Monday. This is the recording of this video. So. After you guys uh, find your swing points, you just need to understand that the market is just, it can only go two ways, up or down. So don't end up confusing yourself or making it extremely difficult. Um, just understand that the market is, um, you know, it's it's exponential. It can only move up or down. It's not, it's not what you guys honestly think it is, to be honest. You know, a lot of people think that they can uh, get down on the five minute without really knowing the higher time frame story and uh, find a supply and demand setup. Or a lot of people think that they can go ahead and rely on indicators such as EMAs and stuff like that. And um, that's not it, guys. You need to be really playing where the institutionalized levels are. And you need to pretty much turn off all of your indicators. Uh, swing points and liquidity by Leviathan and the tape. Um, volume indicators are the only indicators I recommend. Um, due to the fact that volume is going to actually show you guys where price is um, really, um, you know, doing its thing at. So as you guys can see here, we have about a heavy amount of orders down here. We have 48,000, 72,000, 13,000, and 13,000 over here. So a whole bunch of orders down here at this key level at the bottom, letting us know that buying is definitely heavy down here. 
as you guys can see, shorting from all time highs, we have 52,000, um, 40,000 here, and 6,000 here. So that's a heavy amount of volume at all time highs. And as you guys can see, we got a very easy short down into the next level. It's uh, not too difficult, and it just makes it extremely easy on yourself when you guys draw at your higher time frame levels. So all liquidity is, is going to go ahead and show you guys um, pretty much where the amount of orders are before price does the actual move. So Swing Points and Liquidity by Leviathan is really going to help you guys identify where the liquidity is. So there's liquidity up here, liquidity down here, um, liquidity here. And you guys can just go ahead and really draw circles around all your pinpoints if you want. If you're not too good at drawing your own levels, I highly recommend you guys turn on the Swing Points and Liquidity um, by Leviathan indicator. Swing Levels and Liquidity by Leviathan. Highly recommend it. Go ahead and turn it on. Shout out Leviathan. May Allah bless his heart when I, uh, um, if anyone knows him. Can't seem to shout him out, but I would give him a big donation if I could. Um, I wish I could find his email. But um, so yeah, you guys can uh, go ahead and just uh, draw circles around all of your swing point zones if you guys want an easier way to go ahead and do that. And then once you do that, you can go ahead and uh, hit the eyeball and actually turn them off. What you're going to go ahead and identify is key areas of buying and selling going on. So as you guys can see here, all this is is a quick little liquidity sweep before a market did its actual move back up. So market was dumping, 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 dumping. Market decided to create some structure here, went to the final low, ended up breaking out, and then decided to create structure here on this base that it did before. And uh, all it did when it went up here was grab some liquidity, come back down, and then boom, market was able to push up from all-time highs. Why? Because it had enough ammunition here, and the sellers all sold. So letting us know that, okay, people are hungry to buy again because there's enough ammo in the market to go ahead and pump it forward and it's a pretty optimal level um near the uh, ultimate lows so you guys can go ahead and uh, pump it forward and uh, push it to all-time highs so now it has enough ammo so don't confuse yourself guys liquidity is not too too difficult to understand um it's extremely easy to understand honestly um all right so you guys need to just understand a few certain things as well um <clears throat> so um yeah so just be watching out for price action be watching out for aggressive moves in price and don't hesitate in the market guys regardless if you're playing reversals regardless if you're playing breakouts you can't hesitate within the market um, you need to be able to enter the market with confidence and maximum precision and that's what's going to get you profitable inshallah god wills so yeah so that's what a liquidity sweep is guys all it is is the market grabbing ammunition before it does the uh, actual move so all it is is a significant uh, amount of people um, to trigger a, a cluster of buying or selling at a certain or a level. So that's all the liquidity sweep is, guys. Um, and then it's going to go ahead and uh, do its thing. So don't confuse yourself too much. All it is is key levels. You guys can also get with me for mentorship. The first call is going to be absolutely free. Um, I'm working with all budgets as well. You guys can go ahead and also join my Discord where I give a one-day free trial for my signals. Um, you guys can go ahead and catch the trades with me. I hope I make trading extremely easy for you guys, and I don't want anyone to be confused, and I want everyone to become profitable. Inshallah. Um, so, yeah, that is how you do a liquidity sweep, guys. Um, that is a liquidity sweep. All it is is just market grabbing some ammo. Um, yeah, that's it. It's just grabbing ammo and high levels or uh, levels of uh, high volume. Uh, and pretty much that's where the institutionalized orders and the big boy traders that we, where you guys want to be trading with are going to be trading at. So you guys want to be trading with the big dog traders, uh, the people with tens of thousands of contracts and hundreds of millions and tens of millions of dollars. Those are the people we want to be trading with, guys. You want to use them as your friend and not your enemy. At the end of the day, remember that trading is an exchange game. While you're winning, someone is losing. And while you're losing, someone is winning. So you need to always understand this and you need to be putting yourself in the best position to play with the best players at all times. So make sure you guys are staying focused. Make sure you guys are staying disciplined. Make sure you guys are staying prayed up and you guys are going to be able to go ahead and succeed from there. So it's extremely, um, it's extremely easy to go ahead and identify liquidity sweeps. Once again, all it is is the market grabbing ammo before the move, uh, before the market is its actual move. Uh, draw your higher time frame levels, and you guys can scale down to the lower time frames and find your smaller levels through there, and go ahead and farm your ranges. I hope I made it extremely easy for you guys. I'm gonna catch you in the next one. It's been Stack Mo Chris in peace. I'm giving a one day free trial in my Stack Mo Trading Discord for my exclusive signals. Here, I'm going to be giving entry and exit alerts, levels, and trade breakdowns for futures, options, as well as crypto traders. You guys can also purchase lifetime access to the signals, where you guys can pay once and have access to the signals forever.
Here, you guys will also find a link for my one-on-one -on -one mentorship sign up. And let's discuss how to get the best entries. And let's chat about strategy, risk management, psychology, and figure out what's holding you back. I want to help you guys get profitable and payments will be flexible. I'm working with all budgets for my mentorship. If you guys want to help get profitable, make sure you guys join my Discord. And inshallah, let's make some money on.